So we got an oil boiler we're working on today. And uh, it does not have an inline oil filter on it. Uh, the line goes straight from the tank to the burners. There's the copper lines. So what we're going to do, what I'm going to do is cut this line right here and install this spin on oil filter all right so I've got the line cut that's the copper line going to the boiler um, and I've got it cut here and so what I'm gonna do is I'll have to get one of these flare nuts here and I'll slide one on this side and I'll slide one on this side and then I'll flare it <clears throat> and then we'll take our oil filter here I like these pretty good they just spin on and off just like a uh, just like one on your car it just slides on and off you know spins on and off sorry it's got a inlet and the outlet somewhere it'll say but what we'll do one side of it we're gonna screw the inlet side of the filter we're gonna screw a black nipple and a uh, ball valve on the other side we'll just put a flare adapter to hook our other side of the line to. I'll put that all together and show you. Okay, got the uh, got the lines flared. Um, there's a, where I flared it and there's the nut and, and then there's the the inlet side coming from the tank. That's the tank side. That's the boiler side. Okay, here's uh, here's the spin on oil filter. Um, the side with the uh, yellow handle, which is the shutoff valve. That's going to be the inlet side of the filter. So we'll hook it, coming from the tank, we'll hook it here. And then leaving the filter going to the boiler we'll hook it here and uh, that's what she looks like all right I am done there's the filter thank you for watching